मोस्ट ऑफ द टाइम वेन आर आई इंट्रैक्ट स्पेशली इन इन कॉलेज सो दिस री कंडीशनिंग प्लेज एन इम्पोर्टेंट रोल बिकॉज बिकॉज ऑफ दीक प्री कंडीशनिंग Mm-hmm. I tend to behave in the same the uh, earlier uh, 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 whatever the memories I I used to have the earlier interaction. So I wanted to know how to come out of this from those preconditioning. Even I'm even after the interaction, I'll try to recollect it. So this is not the way. Mar, uh, I should not uh, carry forward the previous uh, interactions like that. Yes. so our preconditionings are you know whatever we have assumed about somebody that plays a big role like you're saying isn't it yeah. yes ma'am somebody behaves in not a nice manner with me next time i see that person i remember what he did last time and i start from there isn't it yeah yes yes ma'am so this we'll do in some depth in the exercises but just to be you know to give a brief response to this it's like this are you the same kind of person that you were few years ago or has have your likes and dislikes have your um ways of behaving maybe changed in some things some things you must be the same you might be similar but some things may have changed what do you think yes yeah uh, in some interactions i am able to find that uh, mm-hmm. it is uh, i will not carry those the earlier interactions because of i i will find that it is their lack of competence making that uh, uh, means uh, they are not able to respond in a uh, better manner so yeah. i will not carry forward but uh, where i have the stronger interactions are uh, if the feelings are more stronger mm. so there i am uh, to come out of from that even though i'll try to come out or i will try to ignore it uh, but somehow the outside disturbance makes again and again it is uh, it is the same like that yeah it is so you will notice that it's not just the outside disturbance like you may have noticed some things like this like we give some examples no that when you're calm and comfortable you know the same situation you may respond differently when you're angry or agitated same situation you may respond differently or react differently have you noticed that yeah sure sure ma'am and yeah. also when i am composed am i way of whatever may be the situation outside most of the time so i tend to have how the control over my actions and other things but yeah. if i am a little bit disturbed then the if there somebody in those interactions i'll try to over react it so yeah. so you'll notice that there are two or three points here one is that first of all the other's intention was not to hurt he is lacking only in competence yeah okay. the second thing is that my you know it is an issue with me also because somewhere i am disturbed and i am starting from that point yeah yeah so i need to find out what i am disturbed about to begin with it yes. may be something simple like i am tired i had a long day or you know generally there also you will find most of it is a problem in the self not so much in the body yes sir the body may be tired but if the self is disturbed then um it's it seems like you are more tired sometimes yes it? if you yes. enjoy a good game and you enjoy many good games the body may be tired yes but you still feel good about it yes ma'am yes. but if you had a bad day you had an argument with people now it's like you are very tired and you don't want to think about it you don't want to 
interact with anybody you just want to you're not happy within yourself and you are not happy being with others also it's just uh, like a very disturbed state so yes. that is one more reason and the third reason is that we have many 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 assumptions it's like you know the onion which has so many peels yeah take off one covering there is another one inside you take off that there is another one inside you take off that there is another one inside so like that we have layers and layers and layers of preconditionings within us yeah. so the first thing to do would be to observe what is happening inside because only when you pay attention can you find out what is going on isn't it yeah so this is what we are going to do in the exercises so we'll come to that it's not just for you you will notice I mean, for most of us we will notice this that our preconditionings are often driving us yeah the the, yeah. the feeling that you have at any moment yeah. that is being driven by your assumptions from before your acceptances or non acceptance of somebody or something the situation you know whatever we have assumed about it so now yeah. we have to start seeing if it is in line with understanding or not in line and this is what we'll be doing in the exercise also so we'll come yeah, to yeah one last one thing yes in some in some of the interactions even though my earlier uh, inter- i based on the earlier interactions i will change my way of uh, presenting my uh, problem or suggestion in a different way hmm. sometimes i will not get that conflict also i will present in a different way so that the other person will understand in a better manner and there won't be any conflicts that i will that also i can see one or two times nice but yeah sometimes uh, if i am not able to present it in a better way so there may be a conflict that i will i will also observe it that is i am yeah. finding both are there but major thing is that a little bit disturbance comes more more and more that is what yeah so a lot of times what we are trying to do is in our expression we are trying to change things yeah, yeah. isn't it so that the yes, other yes. doesn't get angry or doesn't you know or is able to get our point we are able to get our point across but the more subtle parts within if they are not in line with understanding then the behavior by itself will be very hard to sustain so that's why you feel you have to control yourself you have to really control yourself and then make sure that you are expressing something that will not disturb the other isn't it yeah, yeah. But, but if within you if you had you know if you could change if you could correct your assumption and with that assumption if you could have that right feeling an assumption or an acceptance that is in line with understanding in line with your natural acceptance with that if you could have the right feeling then all of this will flow then you don't have to control so much it will come just it will flow so we'll get to all that yeah yeah thank you madam thank you thank you